Suppose you know that you can afford a monthly car payment of $250. You find a bank that offers 4.85% interest on a 60-month loan, or a five-year loan, and you want to know what's the largest car loan you can afford. In other words, you're given the monthly payment amount, and you want to calculate the principal on the loan, how much you can actually take out from the bank. This is still an installment loan problem, so we use the same formula, but now what's given is PMT, the payment and what we're asked to find is P, the principal. So we'll solve for the unknown P. So filling in the pieces we know, the payment amount is $250. P is the unknown, so we leave it as P. R is the interest rate, 0 0.0485. N is 12, because we're still making monthly payments, or 12 times a year. And we fill in the rest of the formula the same way. Again here, T is 5, because this is another 60-month loan. But now, we have to simplify everything on the right side there, and solve for P. So I'm going to simplify the entire denominator first, but I'll start inside the parentheses with 1 plus 0 0.0485 divided by 12. Raise that answer to the negative 12 times 5. And then take 1 minus that answer. Now if I'm solving for P, I'll need to multiply this entire denominator over onto the other side. So that entire denominator is the single number, 0.2149, etc. So I'll multiply that by 250. And what I have now is that 53.74 equals P times the rest of the numerator. So if I divide this number by what's in parentheses in the numerator, I'll have P. So if I divide this by 0 0.0485 divided by 12, making sure to keep my parentheses there, that is P. So the principal on the car loan, the amount that we're able to take out, is $13,296. And this is a useful way to start. Start by planning how much you can budget each month for a car payment, and then work backwards to figure out how much of a loan you can take out. And then that added to whatever cash you can put down on the car tells you how much you can afford to spend on this car.